Hello this is Game Chair from Overly Dank Name. I was browsing YouTube and I found this Minecraft creepypasta channel called O1G. While I was looking through his uploads, I learned a valuable lesson. Guys, trust me. Don't. Play. Minecraft. At. 3. A. M. Right where we left off, on this crazy bizarre world, Hero Brian is haunting us. Is this a part 2 to another one of his videos? Because I have no idea what he is talking about. No doubt about that, and I'm pretty sure Herobrine is the main bad guy that we are dealing with here. We are looking out through this window at a house very specifically that we had a very strange encounter with in the previous video. If I had a very strange encounter with your mom in that house last night, O1G. If you haven't seen the previous one, I urge you all to pause this one, go watch it right now. No. I'm assuming you're back. Welcome back. If you're new to the channel, this is the first video you've ever clicked on on my entire upload database, then welcome. Sub So what are we doing today? Well, we are going to be looking a little bit at what we encountered in the previous one. Finding Herobrine underneath your bed is never a thing you want to do. Well, that wasn't a thing that I was planning on doing, that's for sure. Most people are scared of finding the boogeyman underneath their bed, right? Well, I'm terrified of finding Herobrine under mine. Which is exactly what happened, and we are trying to deal with the consequences of such horrible, horrible situation. Like, this, this, is, this is not good, okay? So what I'm saying is, and we gotta be careful, I, every time I almost fall down in there, and to be honest, I don't want to go down and look at that. I don't know what I was expecting to be down there, but it definitely wasn't that. Oh. <laughs> It's so creepy. Anyways, uh, so yeah, what we're gonna do, we're gonna go back over here. We're going to see what is going on in this house. And I, I still need to check the chest, actually. We gotta check this chest. Okay, there's nothing. I don't know why I thought there was maybe something in there. He was right there. That's his mom. I'm in the hole. Oh my. Why does he have a modded in smartphone there? I really should have watched the first video. God, guys, you think there's a secret passage underneath there? See, this is why nobody plays Minecraft at 3 a.m. Did I mention I'm recording this at 3 a.m. right now? See, this is, this is it's nighttime, it's dark, as of the creepy vibe even more. This is why people don't play Minecraft at 3 a.m. They don't want to be scared. They don't want to have to go through this. Okay. I don't know about that. Minecraft is one of my favorite late night games, and that's never happened to me. Okay. This is exactly the opposite of what people people play Minecraft. They want it to be vibrant, bright, enjoyable. Not the case. When you're watching videos on this channel and playing at 3 a.m. Oof. Our phone's here. No more ringing. No more calls from Hero Brian. Again. Who do you think you are? N and A Productions. That's a plus. We don't have to worry about that. This villager. We tried to wake him up, right? And then Hero Brian comes after us. I don't know. There's something weird. If only this villager knew that this Hero Brian. Potentially underneath his bed. We gotta explore underneath there. We gotta see what is going on there. Cause this villager is just sleeping. Like helplessly. Well, of course he's sleeping. It's night time. Also, I'll put some Minecraft gameplay on screen showing how you could easily solve your problem. In here. Let's give him another pack and let's see what happens. Wait, what? Is that? How did you? I didn't even. What did? Whoa, what was that? Did you see that? It's getting daytime now. What just happened? Did you see that? What just happened? I have never. Is what? What he did was he waited in the same spot until it became day then the villager woke up and walked outside then he applied a transition in between the two clips. Okay, sorry, but my brain cannot even process what happened. Boom, 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 boom. Now he's outside. 
How are you outside, sir? I hate to ask this question, but how, what is that? What is that? There's something over here. It's a zombie. How in the world, where's he going? How did that just, how did he just, he was right there and now he's, um. Why is he freaking out? The villager walked and he's scared. Hold up, I wanna follow him. Oh, the baby villager just grew up, that's creepy. How is that creepy? That's a normal game mechanic. That's like me making a video and doing this. Mega Man just bounced. That's creepy. Let's follow him. Just a casual day following him. Nothing to see here. Where's he going? He's on a mission somewhere. Why is he going to the edge of the village? What is it with villagers going to the edge of the village for no reason at all? He's leaving. For what? He packed his bags and left. What's he doing way out here? There's literally no reason for a villager to be out here. There's zero reason. There's something creepy about that villager. In Minecraft, villagers walk around and do things during the day. That isn't even unusual, never mind creepy. There's something very creepy about that villager. His, the way that he acts, the, 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 the weird the, the magic tricks he's performing on us, like... There's something very, very weird about that villager. How... In the world is this stuff possible in Minecraft? Like, how is this happening? I just don't understand. Did I see something moving from here? Is there something down here? Oh, God. Go down that tunnel in the back of the room. What's down there? This creeps me out so much. I don't want to be down here. This world has so many secrets. And I'm terrified. Quite honestly, I'm terrified. So, I, I know people have been urging me to check out the chest for like so mu so many times. Like, you gotta check out the chest. There's probably another book in the chest. Why don't you check out the chest? Look. You showed that earlier in the video. Trying to get more watch time. Oh, one g There's nothing in here. So, we have a potion of healing. We have 20 arrows. An Illager banner. Which we could plop out. We have a regular bow that will probably obtain from some sort of skeleton. Why are you talking like that? Do you realize how uninteresting your own video is? Well, probably from uh, some sort of skeleton. So, um, there's no more books in there. Okay, we, we've kind of figured that out. But, here's the thing. I've never seen a villager do anything weird like that. That was super weird. I don't know if that was a glitch in the game. I think that was a glitch. Have any of you ever been playing Minecraft and got that wacky and crazy glitch where the villager teleports out of its bed and it becomes day? Just me? Okay. Um, but then again, isn't all this weird stuff happening kind of like more or less what you would kind of deem in like a glitch-like fashion. It's kind of glitchy, it's odd, it normally doesn't happen in people's everyday worlds. Or maybe people don't look deeply enough to understand what is truly going on around them in the world that uh, we spawn in and play about with. Uh, I think that that's something very, very uh, important to be in realization of. I didn't ask for the meaning of life, Aristotle. Maybe your world is haunted too, and weird stuff is going on in your world, and Hero Brain is creeping around, and you don't even know. That's what's terrifying. So be careful when you play Minecraft at 3 a.m. so you don't get yourself in a predicament like I'm getting myself in right now. Oh, thanks for the warning. I'll be sure to be careful next time I play Minecraft at 3 a.m. <sighs> well, no Hero Brain, but there is still underneath the bed that we gotta look in. We gotta look underneath the bed, right? Not only do we gotta look underneath the bed... Hmm... We gotta look underneath the bed... 
in the next part or so. There could be a secret passage there, and this could be the answers to everything. This could be because Herobrine's always around this house. So maybe Herobrine's base or something is actually in the house or like around the house. Just dig down there. I don't have all day. Or the better yet. Why don't we just go all the way with this Herobrine thing, right? Let's see if we can truly trigger Herobrine and anger him in a way unlike ever before. Oh yes, I am on the edge of my seat. I am literally pissing my pants right now. Let's actually make a Herobrine spawner, perhaps. Now, I've not made a Herobrine spawner in years, it feels like. So, I think that we should make a Herobrine spawner. See if it activates Herobrine... Well, what could be happening? Herobrine could just be doing his thing. If we make the Herobrine spawner, it could give Herobrine powers. And if that happens, well, we're going to die instantly. It's a video game. You can come back if you die. But then again, I don't know. I want to see what happens if we potentially make a Herobrine spawner. Here's my question to all of you. Should we make a Herobrine spawner in the next episode and see what happens? What is this series called? This video is just called This Is Why No One Plays Minecraft at 3am There's no mention of this being part of a series. And also, hardly anything happened in this video. Just do it now. Oh, this could be a big thing. This could be a big, big deal. I don't know what would happen if we make a Hero Brain Spawner, but this could be huge. I'm going to tell you what. If the likes are good on this video, we will make a follow-up. And we will make the Hero Brain Spawner. Only if the likes are good. So you better share with friends, family. Get them, crush the likes, okay? Let's get the likes to an insane number. All right, we can do it. We got over a million subs here on the channel. Uh, a community as it is, growing every single day. Um, yeah, we might just have to make a hero brain spawner. This is so inspirational and heartwarming. I might just watch which fanboy and chum chum character are you based on your zodiac sign. Let me get a sip here. This has been one journey. It has been one heck of a journey. I tell you guys. It has been one heck of a journey. All right. Here's what I'm going to leave you guys with. Let me know if I should make a Hero Brain Spawner in the next episode. If so, then, well, the next video you see in your sub box might just be me making a Hero Brain Spawner. So wish me luck on that. I might be making the biggest mistake of my Minecraft life. Hopefully not, though. We will have to wait and see. Either way, guys, I love you all so much. Thank oh, I love you too, O1G. Thank you for all the constant support that you are always spreading all the love and positivity in the community that we are growing we are growing each and every day consecutively and uh, with every video we're trying to revolutionize we're trying to eventually get on that trending page i i have to tell you we were so close to getting on ga the trending uh for gaming uh i swear the day this guy gets on trending i'm going to hang myself uh, in the past that it was terrifying i actually think my video almost got there for like a brief second and then it got like took off really quickly um so like we're, we're we're about to make waves we're about to make moves here um so hopefully we can uh hit the trending page very very soon which will be insane going into 2020 that's a greatest new year gift so we can't do that though if the likes are not good and you guys are not sharing the videos we got a goal here let's get on the trending somehow just once and uh yeah without a side i will see you all in the next bro i could hardly even hear you i think he said in the next video but I'm not sure. Also, before I end this video, I just want to say that I don't hate O1G. I am actually glad that he exists. I remember watching a ton of videos like this when I was around 8 years old and being creeped out from them and watching them for hours. I'm glad that the new generation of Minecraft kids will be able to experience these kind of videos, even if they look stupid to us. Finally, if you enjoyed this video and want me to watch the other videos in this series, click the like button. I know it sounds like I'm begging, but I want to see what the viewers enjoy and what to make to get people to keep watching. This is Game Chair, signing out.